Good morning, LHS. Today is Friday, September 30th, 2016. I'm Luke. And I'm Jason. And this is Gail's Wrap. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. One nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Latin Club, learn something more. Tired, eat foods. Latin Club, room 101. Eh. Latin Club? No, this isn't Latin Club. Why are you here? I, I thought the poster said 101. No. We moved. Okay. Are you going to take me there? Come on. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to take you there. Come on, let's go. Yeah, you see, in Latin Club, we like to learn about history. Mm -hmm. And you joined at a very good time for that. We, we like to learn a lot of history. We like to learn about Julius Caesar. Oh, I like Julius Caesar. I'm surprised you've heard of much of them. They don't really teach about it in all oh, the history classes yeah. you've taken. But, uh, uh, one second. We, uh... We ready? Uh, we're, Who are we're just, guys? Let's what? get going. We're gonna... Okay, let's go. Be ready. Conquering Gaul. What's going on? Are, are, really? What are we... A few moments later. What? So that, that was, that was fun. What was even, it? what... Marshall, what? What even was that? Oh, that was just a. We just conquered Gaul. We, oui, we. Oui, I, I don't even speak French. Ah, we just. Eh, it was just Gaul. Is this? Oh, uh, hey. No, we're Hispania. not conquering Hispania. You guys want to conquer Hispania? No. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We're not doing that. I, I, do I go back in? Am I what? I don't know. Twelve seconds later. It wasn't, that was good, right? That was fun. I, I know, isn't it? Isn't exploring other cultures really fun? I, like at first, like the gold golfing was like, uh, whoa, but now it's like, yeah, I know, exploring and cultures. And then making them is our my, culture. It's my favorite it's so thing. Good. Wait, is this the, is that the new Latin group? Yeah, yeah, there it is. You can... What? Yeah. Welcome to Latin Club. LHS did it again. Congratulations on a successful blood drive. With a goal of 70 units, we collected 71. Thanks to the students, volunteers, and staff members, John Smith, Mike Caton, Doug Mose, and Tom Milbaugh, who donated doubles, and a very special thanks to Sydney Labor, who guaranteed our success. My name is Jessica Murphy and I am the president of Spanish Club. My name is Hannah Thomas and I am the public relations officer for Spanish Club. Spanish Club is for students who are interested in the Spanish culture. We celebrate the Spanish culture inside the classroom as well as out. The Pulsera Project is a nonprofit organization that educates, empowers, and connects the students of the United States with local artisans in Guatemala and Nicaragua. We're selling them September 30th through October 11th in the GAC during lunch period. The money we raise from the Pulsera Project will go back to the local artisans in Guatemala and Nicaragua to help benefit their families. The bracelets are really cool and unique and they're only $5. By purchasing the pulsaires, you get the hand-woven bracelet along with a picture of the artist and their signature. We really hope that you choose to buy one of the unique hand-woven bracelets. They're for a really great cause. Musica, musica, musica. Attention all students who are scheduled for financial literacy class this nine weeks. Financial literacy is now an online course through Odyssey. You must pass this important course in order to graduate high school. 
It is your responsibility to stay on track and complete the course by the end of the nine weeks. As of today, September 30th, if you, are, you need to be 66% complete. See Mr. Evans in room 501 for help. Thank you to all the students who exercised their voice and voted for homecoming court. The results are 9th grade representative Madison Mallory, 10th grade representative Eva Brown, 11th grade representative Kayla Ivory. Homecoming queen containers are Finley Coker, Cameron Peters, Alyssa Tobin, Heather Walker. Voting for our homecoming will be open through Tuesday at 12 o'clock. Spirit Week is next week to celebrate homecoming week. Each day we will have a themed dress up day, a prep rally on that Friday, the homecoming parade before the football game, and the homecoming dance on that Saturday. Tickets for the dance are on sale now and next week. Tickets are $5. In October 3rd through 6th, tickets are $6. No ticket sales Friday, October 7th. Guests must be registered and approved by your dean. Pick up the required form from the main office. doing? Next Friday, October 7th. Don't forget. Yeah, you're ready. What are you still doing here, dude? October 7th. Next Friday. What took you so long this morning? There was this crazy guy in my house and he was talking about the student staff dodgeball game. Don't forget. Here are the theme choices for a prom. We like pink. Mom, give me a minute! Ah! Let's go, Gales. Go, Gales. Before we leave you, here's an important message. Have a good day. And as always, go Gales. Good morning, Lancaster High School. I'm very, very privileged to introduce Ashley Cook to you. She has a lot to tell you about her new friend and our friend, new service dog, Fanta. So Ashley's going to explain um, some things about the dog, which you will be seeing here at Lancaster High School. Many of you have already seen Fanta. So again, you can't pet the dog. You can't, you know, do anything that you would do to a with a normal pet at this time. And Ashley will explain that. Have a great day, and as always, go Gales. What is the name of your dog? Her name is Fanta. And what breed is she? She's a lab retriever mix. So why do you need her? Um, she's a mobility dog, so she helps me with. Um, she picks things up that I drop. Has she had any special training? Like, where was she trained at? 
She was trained at Fort Paulus for ability in Zeno, Ohio. Did you have to go through any training with her? Yeah, I had to go for two weeks. So are any other students or staff members allowed to pet and feed her? Um, as of right now, no. And then is there anyone else who can give her commands other than you? No, except for like an emergency situation where I cannot give the commands. Um, so when I follow or find help, um, she's trained to bark on command. I just wanted to thank everyone who helped me raise money for Fanta. It was a long process, but I know a lot of people here at the school helped, and so thank you.